Welcome to STAB exam forum. We have come up with a new video on let's solve PYQ and in this particular session we are going to solve previous year question paper of ISRO assistant junior assistant UDC exam that was held in year 2016. Okay and the section which we will cover today will be reasoning section. Okay so without wasting any time let's begin the session. And the first question is on your screen and your time start now. Uh, student, this question is from the category called coding decoding. Okay. It is very important section in all the competitive examination. Okay. So you need to decode the word how it is being coded. Okay. So let's see the word. The word is friend. Okay. F R I E N D. Okay it is coded as h u m j t k okay so you need to establish a relationship between these two words so how this uh, is being coded okay so if you look uh, just see the characters f g h so after adding one character you are having the next character okay f g h r s t so in between there are two characters so we are adding two characters and we get the third character i j k j k l m so in between there are three characters so we are adding three characters okay so it will be so on like this plus four plus five and plus six okay so the word we wish we need to write is a candle okay so let's write the candle first c a n d l e okay so as i told you uh, there should be one character between these okay so c d and next should be e so out of these four options you can straight away eliminate option one and option two okay now next is uh, there should be addition of two characters a b c next should be d so as you can see option 3 has only d as a second position so option 3 is the right answer okay you need not to go further you can use the elimination strategy uh, just now we have solved like that okay so option 3 is the right answer okay coming to the next question uh, it is again from the coding decoding a very simple one okay again it is from coding decoding okay and the now word is zebra okay so how it is coded it is written as 2652181 okay student don't afraid with this number this is very simple as you can see z position number is 26 and e is position as 5 and a is position at 1 similarly r is position at 8 okay and so on okay so if you see cobra let's see how it is written cobra as i told you earlier there is a uh, shortcut called ijoti okay so with the help of uh, this uh, shortcut you can find the position of the alphabet like 5 10 15 20 25 so c stand for as you know it is 3 so all option have 3 so we can eliminate option 4 then O as you know it is uh, position dependency is 15 so 315 should be there so out of this option 2 has only 315 so we are left with option 2 and option 2 is the right answer okay let's see the next question it is odd and out a very simple but uh, you should know the meaning of the word given in the options so odd one out uh, which is uh, which does not fall in the same category you need to eliminate that uh, option okay so as you know vapor mist and fog these are form of uh, some water droplet or you can say it is form of some water okay but hailstone is generally an ice stone okay it is an ice stone it is uh, generally in solid form whereas vapor mist and fog are in gaseous form okay so you can eliminate all these three and so your answer should be three and three is the correct answer 
quickly moving to the next question and your time starts now it is again from the coding decoding so as i told you uh, you can find three to four question from coding decoding okay so just prepare very well okay so as you can see e f g h i okay so there is a difference of five characters okay j k l m n o so there is again plus five o p q r s t so after fifth after addition four or the fifth state you will get t similarly you can proceed uh, and check all these characters okay so let's uh, go with the next h after that h you should have plus five right so after h what uh, character should have i j k l and m should be there okay so m should be there so out of these four option you can eliminate option one and option four after m there's again addition of five characters m n o p q and r should be there okay so r should be there so out of these two option you are left with option two okay understood so just it is addition of five characters in each of these alphabet so the right answer is option two okay and option two was the right answer let's see the next question it is uh, very simple but very tricky it is called logical sequence okay this category is called logical sequence okay so you need to make a sequence a meaningful order using this word okay so there can be many possibilities but the best meaningful order you need to pick so if you analyze all these uh, words you will find first a person observe so option 4 okay after observing what we should do we should listen okay once we listen then we need to analyze okay after analyze we should judge okay and after judging we should act so option 2 that is 4 2 3 5 1 is the right answer okay understood okay let's see the next question it is from the category called direction test and direction test where you need to tell the direction based on some condition okay so i am facing east okay just make this note east west uh, sorry east north west south so you are facing east means you are facing in this direction okay now you turn 100 degree clockwise okay so let's make a quadrant so you are facing here so you make 100 degree in clockwise so this is this is clockwise so this is 90 so you have turned in this position okay so make it this as a 100 degree okay this is 100 degree now what you did you again rotate with direction 145 degree in anti clockwise okay so anti clockwise is reverse of clockwise so after moving uh, 145 so this is 100 and this is 45 okay this is total 90 so this is 45 so you are right now in in this direction so what this is north this is east so north east is the right answer okay so option 2 is the right answer okay let's see the next question okay so what the question says question says in total population of 70 20 20 milk tea milk and tea 35 drink milk and uh, select the following venn diagram how many drink only me how many drink only d tree and answer the following question so you need to make venn diagram for this particular question so uh, if you add all these uh, first it should be 70 okay so 35 plus 50 as you know it is uh, not total as 70 so uh, you can eliminate if you see this 20 20 20, 20. how much 60 again you can eliminate this this is 25 25 20 50 50 50 plus 6 20 70 okay then this is uh, 35 plus uh, 15 that is 40 uh, 50 60 70 so out of these two option you need to pick okay so let's see read the next statement 
if 20 drink milk and tea okay so both have this common as 20 so it is right 35 drink milk okay so if you see this as 35 so this means they uh, are only drinking milk so this represent 35 and the remaining this much drink only tea okay so option 4 seems to be the valid one okay so option 4 is the right answer let's see the next question this type of question we have seen in all the ISRO exam this is called interchange of numbers okay interchange this we have seen in all the years okay a very simple one okay so what you need to find the lowest number okay lowest number uh, it is very simple student just uh, see the uh, reverse the number okay just first and last you need to interchange okay so this two become in front okay so here this is the lowest at present again eight this is not lowest six it is not less than two eight it is not less than two so option one is the correct answer okay this is very simple since you need to find the lowest you need to see the uh, most significant number digit at the front okay so if they ask highest again you need to uh, look for this particular digit okay okay after interchanging of course okay so option one is the right answer let's see the next question it is from the category called analogy okay there you need to establish relationship between the given words okay so yard is to inch okay so as you know yard is also a unit of uh, measurement and inch is also a unit of measurement okay so quart as you know it is again a unit of measurement but with respect to whom okay so as you know out of these milk and liquid you can straight away eliminate it as these are not unit okay as these are not unit of measurement so uh, you are left with option one and two gallon and house both are a unit of measurement but uh, for this particular question as you know gallon uh, unit is greater than quarts okay and greater than ounce ounce is the smallest of all okay so if you see the relationship between yard and inch yard is greater than inch okay similarly what you need to find you need to find what relation so that quarts is greater than uh, the following unit so option two as quart is greater than ounce so option two should be the right answer okay so option two is the right answer okay let's see the next question it is again from the odd man out you can say it is classification basically odd man out so as you know all these cornea retina pupil these are parts of eye these are parts of an eye okay it this is parts of an eye whereas vision is not a part so vision is the odd man out so option four is the right answer okay let's see the next question uh, this is from the blood relationship okay in all the competitive examination you have at least one question on blood relationship and as i told you for these type of question you need to know how to draw the tree diagram okay so let's make a tree diagram for that so p is mother of k okay so p is mother of k and k is sister of d okay and d is father of d sorry d is father of j how is p related to j as you can see there is one generation so p should be grandmother of j okay it is grandmother of j so option two was the right answer okay so option two is the right answer let's see the next question it is from the non-verbal category non-verbal okay and it is basically from the embedded figures okay embedded figures so you need to uh, make a uh, use of these things to make uh, uh, these figures so let's see so as you can see you can eliminate this option why because this is 90 degree 
uh, right angle triangle but here there is no piece of right triangle okay again uh, as you can see this is isosceles this is scaling uh, right angle but not perfectly okay so you can eliminate uh, this option because there are two isosceles uh, two right angle triangle okay similarly if you see this this has square in it uh, so you can eliminate this also so we are left with option 2 as you can put also this represent this triangle and other represent these two triangles so option 2 is the right answer so option 2 is the right answer let's see the next question I think this is the last uh, question for this particular section okay so this is uh, from the meaningful word okay so you need to make a meaningful english word from the letter e n a l okay so as i told you there are how many possibilities one two three four four factorial possibility will be there okay so instead uh, we should make meaningful word by our assumption only so first uh, letter which you can come into your mind is lane okay lane is the first word second uh, word can come in your mind is lean lean is very thin okay and the third and the most important word is allen okay this uh, word generally student miss okay allen what does this allen means allen means energy okay this word means energy okay so generally we uh, only represent these two uh, words with this but allen is also one possibility and this allen word mean energy it is meaningful word so there are three words that which we can form from the letters e and a l okay so option three is the right answer this is not option two this is option three option three is the right answer okay so student we have already made a uh, various video on ISRO assistant exam for year 2014-2012 and now we are releasing for 2016 okay so you have lot of previous year question paper that we have solved you will not find such questions in uh, any YouTube video okay so you if you are interested you can have a look on our playlist that is let's solve pyq isro assistant okay so that's it student we will come with the next video on arithmetic so if you have anything to say you can write in our comment box okay so thank you for watching and have a nice day